up to make some Roselle juice. It's too small. This is big enough. Okay. I'm going to make a juice with Roselle. Okay, I've taken this from my own garden. Okay, this is Roselle. Okay, how we do it is very simple. First thing, we remove this layer, the outer layer. Okay, you can just drop it into the water. Okay. Drop it. Okay, it's very simple. This part you keep, it's the seed. It's the seed, okay, you dry it and then you can replant it. It's just this and rock sugar, just two things only. Make a lovely juice for a hot day. Since the weather is very hot nowadays, okay, it's almost like a heat wave here. Actually, you don't have to wait, you can put the rock sugar. This is rock sugar. Rock sugar is cooling, so we use rock sugar. And let it boil. The sweetness depends on you. Okay, some of your learn it sweet, some of your don't. So it depends on you. And when put all, if it's too sweet, you can dilute it later. And let us mix it. You need to stir it so that the rock sugar will melt, okay? And this one needs to be a bit, you know, the color will come and become a bit soft and colorless. Until then, you have to do it, lah. okay? Can you see the color? It's a sweet pinkish color. So now, it's done and ready to be served. Let me serve it. Of course, you remove the, the petals of the leaf or whatever you call this. Okay, off the stove first. Okay, I'm going to remove it. I'm going to remove it like this. Okay, you don't need this part of it. Doesn't matter whether it's light or not, but it makes a good tea. juice you can drink it it's good for you okay it makes a very good tea you can drink it hot as tea but if you prefer you can just put it in the fridge and make it cool and drink it i think the kids would love that better okay thank you